Hi, my name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and today I'm sharing a recipe from one of my favorite cookbooks. The recipe is for peanut brittle cream cheese cookies. These cookies are absolutely perfect for the holidays. So let me show you what you're going to need. And as always, I'll make sure to leave the recipe in the description box. You are going to need sugar, flour, butter, an egg, vanilla, baking soda, softened cream cheese, and crushed peanut brittle. So the first thing we're gonna do is to cream our butter, which is softened and at room temperature, our cream cheese, which is also soft and at room temperature, and our sugar. I'm just gonna use a hand mixer and beat it until it's light and fluffy. And now I'm going to add in my egg, which is at room temperature, and a little bit of vanilla, and give it another mix. Now I'm just going to fold in my peanut brittle. And my baking soda. And my flour. So now I've got the dough all mixed up. It was pretty easy to stir. It wasn't very stiff at all, but it is pretty sticky because we've got that cream cheese in there. So now I am going to cover the bowl and then I am going to refrigerate this dough for about three hours. Okay, so I let my dough chill. And so now what I'm gonna do is just take my cookie dough, roll it in a ball, and just place it right on the cookie sheet. And I am using a one and a half tablespoon scoop to do that. Okay, so now that I've got my dough on the cookie sheet, I'm just taking a fork that I have dipped in water, and then I'm just making the traditional peanut butter crisscross on my cookies. Now, the directions say to dip your fork in flour, and I've never done that before when I've made peanut butter cookies, so I'm not gonna do that now. Um, and then it also says after you make the crisscross um, on your cookie, to sprinkle your cookie with sugar, but I'm not gonna do that either. I feel like these have enough sugar, but um, I'm just gonna keep going here. So I have crisscrossed all my cookies. I've got my oven preheated to 350 degrees. I'm gonna bake these for about 10 to 12 minutes or until they are light golden brown. Okay, so here are the peanut brittle cookies. I let them cook for about 13 minutes each batch, and they are pretty tasty. They are not very sweet. They're kind of like a shortbread type cookie. And my husband, who is not a big fan of peanut brittle, really likes these cookies. Now, if you want your cookies a little bit more sweet, I would definitely sprinkle the sugar, sugar on top. Also, another thing I wanna mention is definitely use parchment paper. With that first batch, you'll remember I did not use any parchment paper and they stuck to the cookie sheet. The next couple of batches, I did use parchment paper, no problem at all. So anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.